Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at an exciting new collection from Anchor and Heart Lacquer. You guys will have heard me talk about this brand before in Swatch Fest and talking about Polish Pickup. I'm a huge fan of their brand and I'm always so excited to see what they're going to do for Polish Pickup. So I'm so pumped. This time I get to swatch a full collection for you. This collection is launching on March 29th. It's called the Nautical Neutrals Collection. And just look at this color palette. It is divine. It's such perfection. Ugh, I love this so much. So this is what we're gonna look at today. We're gonna do live application of everything, just as always. We have six creams here, and for the most part, we've got shifty shimmers going through all of them, and one has some micro flakies. These are all very pigmented. We're just gonna do two coats of everything. As always, I'll put the link to the website in the description bar below, so you can hop over there and check them out. We're gonna go in alphabetical order before we get started. Do you guys ever try to match your lippy with what you're wearing on your nails? It's kind of fun sometimes, especially if you're wearing a neutral. On my nails, I have the neutral from the collection that we're gonna look at very last because it's the old port. So it has a later name in the alphabet. And on my lips, I have this um, ColourPop Ultra Satin Lip in Mess Around. I didn't, I didn't match it perfectly. But it was kind of fun. So first up, we're going to do the green and the blue. First up is this awesome kind of sea green turquoise shade. Oh, it's so pretty. This is called Make Waves. Like I said, these are all very pigmented, so they swatch just perfectly in two coats. I'm going to be sharing everything with top coats, try to pull out that shimmer a little bit, and really give them all a glossy look on the nails. So this starts with this beautiful turquoise base, and then inside it has this green to blue shimmer, and it's such a soothing shade. I love a nautical theme. These colors are just perfection, you guys. The combination of these colors, she just hit it right on the nose and the application is so nice and easy. So this first one is Make Waves. I love the shimmer in this. If I were a mermaid, this is what I would want the color of my tail to be. The next polish in the collection is the blue. This is kind of like a dusty cornflower blue and it's so beautiful. This is called Out to Sea and I believe that the shimmer in this one is going from like a turquoise to a pink. Ooh, it's so pretty. It might be like turquoise violet pink and it feels like some silver shimmer going on in there too. Again, this swatch is just like the previous one. It's super duper easy in two coats. This builds up opacity very quickly. The other thing I really like about this collection with the addition of this shimmer, they all have this bright flash up off the surface of the nail that gives kind of a look of the water and the reflection that you get off the top of the water and I just think it's so pretty. This one is out to sea. I did two coats and my photos with top coat as well. Next up we have Perfect Storm and thank you so much they put a gray in here. Oh, it's so gorgeous. This is a lighter gray. It's definitely like on a light smoky side and inside I see a kind of like indigo to violet shimmer or like indigo to fuchsia and again we have that silver gleam coming off the top of it. These polishes are giving me the feels and they're giving me just like the very calm, relaxing, while still being devastatingly beautiful feels. That's what this collection is doing to me. So this one's called Perfect Storm. I swatched it at two super, super easy coats, finishing off everything with top coat today, and my photos are all two coats as well. So Perfect Storm is the perfect gray. Next up we have two polishes that are kind of in the coral family. This first one's more of like a peachy coral, and then we have more of like a very warm, orangey red coral. So the first one's called Sailor's Delight and I love this one so much. This is the one that has the micro gold flakies and it's just stunning. Both of these two polishes that we're going to look at here have very warm elements to them. Sailor's Delight swatches just like the rest of them. Super super easy two coats and it's packed with this gold shimmer and these gold micro flakies that are just so bright. They really pull out against this polish. Just make it for the perfect warm coral, you guys. This is just going to be amazing on your toes this summer. This is Sailor's Delight. It was two easy coats with taco. And then the next one is slightly darker, and this time we're back to shimmer. I think this one has a red to green Aurora pigment in it. It's super, super bright. It's making this very warm. It's kind of looking like it's blazing, like it's got a fire underneath the base of this polish. Ooh, 
it's so pretty. This is called Seafarer. And like I said, it's darker than the last one we looked at. It almost looks like a reddened salmon base. And then you have just tons of that Aurora Shimmer. Super, super shifty. So this one is Seafarer. I did two easy coats with top coat. at the last polish in the collection. This is the one I was showing you guys at the beginning that I was trying to match my lipstick. So this polish is called the Old Port and it is a beautiful taupe. So pretty and I feel like it has like some violet undertones which are aided by the fact that this has a beautiful um, like dark royal blue to violet shifty shimmer in here. Again with the beautiful soft silver gleam coming off of it as well. I'm so in love with this one, you guys. This is my new favorite neutral um, because you know I love taupe. And then, I mean, give me some purple and blue shifty shimmer in that taupe. It's devastating. So this swatches so nicely. These polishes are all just like easy polishes to work with. If you don't want a high fuss manicure for the day, but you're still wanting some great color payoff, these ones are fantastic. So this one's the Old Port. I did two coats just as with everything and I finished off with the top coat and we're already at the end of this collection you guys I'm almost sad about it because I just want to keep talking about these forever um so yeah definitely let me know down in the comments below what is your favorite do you have a favorite anchor and heart polish you've ever tried I am particularly fond of their Crelly polishes so when you're over on their website checking out these polishes I'm talking about the finishes that are packed with cute little glitter mixes they do them so so well I'm a total fan of their color combos. So you guys, this is the Nautical Neutrals collection. I hope you had some fun hanging out with me today, getting to watch some beautiful polish be swatched. And yeah, let the maker know down in the comments below, what is your favorite? So you guys, I will see you back for the next one very soon. I hope you're having a super day. Take care until I see you again. Love you guys, bye.